<coughs> Hello, Assalamu alaikum. Today I am going to make a video regarding the MRCS Part A exam. So, maybe many of you have known about the MRCS exam Part A, which is one of the prestigious postgraduate exam which is known to all over the world at least 52 European countries along with the other countries who are very much well known about the membership exam from the Royal College of Surgeon as you know that in our country it's also prestigious so today I'm going to give you the information about the examinations and the study materials regarding MRCS exam so what are the advantages of MRCS so there is no need of pre-course training online exam centers so you can give exams from anywhere from the world which uh, there are some exam centers uh, which is well known for different online exam centers they are available for B exam centers outside the UK so you must not go to the UK for part B you can also give exams from your neighboring countries like India, Egypt, Malaysia like the other countries so the curriculum of the MRCS is there are two exam in one day first one is about ABS applied basic science about 180 minutes in 180 SBA that is single best answers so for each and every answer you need one minute and after a small quite a break then you will have to seek for another exam that is POSG principal practice of surgery and that is 120 minutes in 120 SBA so here also one SBA in for each minute so it's quite a long period of exam so five hours at least three and two so that is you need to have uh, more confidence along with your mental capability to keep the exam in one day Now the working advantages and the benefits of the MRCS. So in UK after MRCS there is no need to seat for PLAP or UKMLA. Direct GMC registrations, so no need to attend for uh, other GMC examinations like PLAP or UKMLA which is recently started. So if you are uh, have done MRCS, so you don't need to go for PLAP or UKMLA. In NHS foundations, you can have posting as a senior house officer, which is equivalent to register post in Bangladesh. So, junior house officer uh, is no need. So, junior house officer is uh, the requirement of PLAP. So, after PLAP, you need to go through a core specialty training, then you can have the GMC registration, then the senior house officer. It is a long way. So if you do MRCS after MBBS, then senior house officer is the direct post. So uh, nowadays in the UK there is a National Health Society Foundation NHS. So there are a lot of posts which is available. So if you, anyone wanted to uh, settle in the UK so MRCS is a good option before MRCS no need to complete OET or IELTS so in case of MRCP or PLAB OET or IELTS is the prerequisite first and foremost priority so first you have to complete the IELTS or OET then uh, MRCP or PLAB exam is uh, 
is the choice but here in the MRCS no need to see for weight so there are many opportunities ahead in the corporate hospitals as well as in the medical colleges and the another thing is short curriculum so comparatively easier than the FCPS or MS exam because they are long courses there are some training facilities you must ensure and as well as uh, uh, you have to there are some thesis or uh, dissertation you must go through so uh, there are some difficulties sometimes to complete those stages but in universities there is uh, no such kind of thesis or dissertations so much structured exam process so you can easily assess your skills and knowledge by uh, proper OSCE skills and the MCQ of different clinical aspects. Now the time requirements for study for purpose for MRCS. If you are freshers, then it is about six months you need at least. No other PG preparation in the same time, so you must not take another process of studies because uh, in our country of the PG preparation was a lot more vast not so specific that's why you have to study specifically with the full dedications full group discussion with fellow members or partners joined with the study group so there are many study groups in the uh, Facebook as well as telegram app so what are the study materials so some of you asked me about the study materials that is the EMRCs and past test in few topics for the sheet recall recall and recall so recall is the most important things here because you know the uh, you must know the mcq pattern uh, to because you must be go through different clinical aspects but the presentations or uh, the requirement to give perfect uh, correct answer you must know the pattern of question Umaima notes, the notes and Nasaka notes, these are the notes which is uh, worldwide recognized. So you can go through as a reading of these notes. So no need to go to the textbooks. Here, yeah, must remember. You will never finish or summarize, for example. Don't go for textbooks. Study principle, practice of surgery, O Garden, 7th edition. It is this book is a very much wonderful book for clinical aspects so you must know the clinical scenarios or uh, clinical uh, uh, aspects you must know from the garden book because in short uh, you can complete this book for second exam that is 120 uh, SBA now the there are some other books which is a little bit easier smaller so like in the vvn mrcs svm which is also called the lumpel division guide so it, it has 600 questions i hope so 600 questions and the oxford specialty training book sba for mrcs it also has 600 uh, sba pattern questions and their explanation and the last one is pradeep sba in q uh, vast if no time that is don't study it because uh, it is a recognized book as a SBA but not specific for MRCS. Many uh, clinical scenarios is present there but uh, not everything is needed. So if you have small time then please don't go for that. How to start and continue booking for exam? So first start with real notes and Omaima notes Nasaka. To assess your knowledge, first you have to assess your knowledge as well as uh, where is the defects and how, why you are doing so wrong answers. You must know that first. They study merge EMRCS simultaneously at the same time. After completing notes, you go for uh, recalls and FOSIA sheet because FOSIA sheet is nothing like uh, uh, exam pattern questions and the recalls, which is so much similar just revise the following things for four times so four times the at least uh, four times you must go through each questions uh, to know the, the what they ask uh, 
or, or what they want to assess then dissolve recall recall and recall so go for recalls if you see for january so uh, you must know the three to five years of january questions if you go for september then three to four years of september questions or <coughs> that's why uh, recall is very important solve the nice to know books for higher concepts so when emrcc is completely done along with fujiyashis and recall then you go for higher concepts gather money for booking at least 600 pound that is it is one of the costly exams after the usmle so you must go for, you must think about your money matters because if you fail 600 pound another important risky factor is you can go through part a for six times only just remember six time you can sit for immersive for six time after that the dream of immersive is gone gone forever after the part a you have to complete possibly part b within seven years of completion of part a just remember that when you pass immersive part a then there is a seven years ahead within this time period you have to complete that is past part b oski exam and the oski exam is only four times you can only sit for four times for the oski exams and it is lot more a lot more costly like uh, 1020 pound or like this kind of so groups discussion problem solving questions so join uh, to some groups in fa uh, facebook at master the immersive part study group which is one of the largest group of the uh, um, facebook on the mrcs success with hashim versus academy part a doctor's academy or academy part a this kind of groups and the telegram groups are good media for update documents and discussions so there are other telegram groups uh, that are available to some coaching centers along with some mentors based studies so you can go for that if you need anyone like this why to find materials how to minimize so maximum documents are pdf manners so, but in uh, bd they are also found as offline hard copy like Thakam in the pg medical book house or, and all the others in the other shops also found on the study group in content you can go through a telegram study group or facebook or whatsapp or uh, facebook pages and you go for content content option you can have a lot of shared document you can easily download and uh, go for the each pdf time to time last and foremost advice is it is costly exam for international medical students graduate that is img so before the exam please be confident about your knowledge and performance the mock, mock test before mock test don't book for this because if you book if you give exams if you give money then uh, the refund process is a lot more tougher than the normal one so you may fail to reveal every money because there are some loss like 20 percent to 30 percent you have to face the loss so don't be panic the earlier you start the earlier you pass if you uh, don't then don't be upset second time you sure so best of luck if you're interested then you can study with my video content that i'm going to publish day by day so in youtube so stay tuned um, and uh, best of luck thank you very much So I hope uh, there will be some next videos uh, that I'm going to discuss and also it will be affected for me for part B. So thank you uh, again. So be stay tuned. Thank you.